Hi everyone, thanks for joining me. Um, so today we're gonna to be talking about what to do if you receive the new breadcrumbs issue detected for your site from Google Search Console. So you've probably received an email that looks something like this. Uh, it says there's a new breadcrumbs issue detected on and then your URL, and then it'll tell you what that warning's for. Specifically, we're gonna talk about if you've received the data vocabulary.org um, was deprecated, and that's the issue. So if you click on the blue button, it'll bring up your Search Console report and it'll show you exactly where you have those errors. Uh, if I click on it here, it'll show that within my code, I'm using the data vocabulary.org um, for representing my breadcrumbs. So if that's what you're seeing, um, what you need to understand is that the data vocabulary.org um, is, is being deprecated, which means it's, it's no longer going to be supported. And instead, what you'll need to do is implement the actual schema.org markup for breadcrumbs. So I'll post a link to this developers.google um, URL that outlines the data types um, for breadcrumbs. And I'll also post a link for this uh, Search Console help thread, which talks about what this means. And basically, you know, the, uh, the um, way that this was done before, you had the, the data vocabulary.org structure and it, it needs to convert to schema.org structure um, it's just deprecated the old system so you know again that's that's going to be for kind of web developer talk in terms of how that's done um, but the step that you should take is to talk to your developer and say that it needs to be migrated um, from the to the more widely shared vocabulary from schema.org um, that's specifically what you want to say now if your website's really driven by a plugin or a theme um, you want to check and see if the developers released an update uh, that may have accounted for this. So the data vocabulary.org structured data would then be replaced with the schema.org um, structured data. But that's really where that issue is coming from and why you're receiving that. So either you know do one of two things: look for an update from the plugin um, or the theme developer uh, for your exact you know website, depending on what platform you're on, or just contact your web developer and specifically say that you're receiving this warning or this error, and you need to move from the data vocabulary.org structured data to the schema.org, and they'll work on that implementation process. That's something your developer will need to handle or the plugins or apps or theme developer that built your theme will need to handle. So hope that video helps, um, but that's what that means, and that's how to solve it. Again, we'll put the links below the video. Thanks.